a, uh, a sort of a fluid particle simulation running with all these uh, you know colorful uh, red, green, and blue blue balls here, um, and then that physics simulation in the game engine is ultimately feeding the geometry, which then gets rendered in the scene. So you got the physics engine and the game engine asynchronously running relative to the graphics. And with async off, you know we're doing about I guess you know 70 some high 70s FPS uh, running running this demo. And then if we can turn, so you can see the fraps counter never left there. So you, if we, can we turn async on now? Okay, now, now with async on, we've now gone up to about 93 FPS, which I think is kind of 15, 20-ish percent faster. And basically what's happening is that the, uh, this physics workload by itself, sometimes it builds a machine, but then you, when you have these fluid calculations, there's gonna be a point at the end where there might not be as, lo as much compute work to do. And so you sort of have some dead time on the machine. And now we're rendering the graphics here with the shadows and the lighting and everything. We can actually overlap that graphics work with the compute work. And so now we're able to run, run more efficiently so the overall workload runs, runs better.